The first day of spring meant it was time to shed the winter coats for a collection of sheep belonging to Kathy and Larry McIntyre of Avondale. The sheep were being sheared in front of very interested members from the Fiber Ladies, a fleece spinning group that meets monthly in Pueblo, completing a first step in the long process of turning the sheared wool into yarn for the spinners and other crafters. Well, um, uh, two gals here are in my spinning group, and then um, two other gals came to the um, March 1st Women's Heritage Day at the El Pueblo Museum and they have an interest in fiber and so I knew that I had this uh, appointment and they wanted to come to see. It's really nice that people want to be a part of all of uh, this very fundamental foundational uh, life. The sheep are sheared annually and the harvested wool is processed in Mora, New Mexico where it is cleaned and turned into stretches of long wool which the fiber ladies spin into yarn in a process called roving. This fleece could be sold to someone. They could wash it themselves and hand cart it and then spin it. So that's why we try to take off as much vegetable matter so it makes it a little bit simpler process for them. But some of this wool is going, the majority of it's going to go to a mill to be processed into roving, which is the wool ready to spin. And then some of it will be spun into yarn at the mill also. Oh, yeah. oh, well, I think this one's been dibbed already. The end results are scarves like these, worn by Rachel Gutierrez, a Colorado Springs resident who traveled to Pueblo just to view the shearing. I went to Pueblo to meet the Spinner's Guild um, at this beautiful event they had at a museum. We made such good friends with them. They were such lovely people that they actually gifted me, my mother, and my two children with a handmade scarf. So to feel the wool, it's, it's just different. You know somebody spun it by hand. You know they knitted it for you. It's just it's like wrapping up in love every time you put it on. It's amazing. Fiber ladies meet monthly at the El Pueblo Museum the first Tuesday of each month from 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. For more information, read Mary Jean Porter's story in the Sunday Pueblo Chieftain.